evening. Whew. So, I've just come in from rehearsals. Um, I, I guess because some people have been following the blog, there'll be new people coming to it. Um, I'm James Hunter. I'm one member of North 15 this year, which I've had the privilege to do courtesy of Northern Stage. And currently we're a few weeks into rehearsal for Serrano de Bergerac, which is the tour where we're taking away down to Northampton and then back up to Northern State, which is exciting. Um, so yeah, I mean, the last time I did this, I blogged today sort of six six weeks ago. Um, in North, we sort of have a rotational way of working it out, so it's, uh, it's a good crack. But I thought this week, I thought, why not see our lovely faces? Or oh, I say ours, maybe it's just mine. Um, as you can see, actually, I've got a bit of a bit of a beard coming on. It's not necessarily purely for the play, but um, I think it will come in handy with some of the characters I'm playing. Um, so yeah, Monday, Monday the twenty third of March. God, how it's flown! Like when you start in January, it seems to have absolutely been rapid. Um, but yeah, this morning we started with movement. Um, we're fortunate enough to work with Ballet Lorraine and uh, Caroline Liv came in today and we've been looking at various sort of battle scenes throughout the play. Um, but as always, we started with, I wouldn't say a relaxing warm-up, it's quite nice. We'll, we'll start with a couple of, um, we'll walk around the room, the, the rehearsal room we're in is great, the Savile Exchange in North Shield is brilliant. And we'll walk around and then we'll finish with sort of interval sprints which really get your heart racing. Um, which I mean, I've got a bit of a cold at the moment, so it really sort of clears clears it out in a in a sense. So that's really good. Um, and then we'll go into stamina exercises, which will be sort of uh, we'll look at doing Pilates, which is sort of ab exercises. Um, we've then got different variations of ab exercises. We will then do plank, side plank, press ups. So it's all about core strength because a lot of what Ballet Lorraine do is is about throwing each other around but doing it in such a sense where it's safe to do it and a lot of our movement we find is 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 from the core where you go and where you're at are you centered are you in the right position such a thing so throughout north we've been developing it and throughout rehearsals we've been taking that sort of experience in which is great and um, so once we've done all the stamina exercises warmed ourselves up we've got a kind of contemporary or ballet routine that we'll go through as well and then some swing exercises um and again, using using our stamina to see to see how we get on with that, because basically, by doing the stamina exercises, we're going to be ready to perform the show. And I say that in a sense of it's an absolute beast. It's a big show. It's going to be really physical. It's going to be a lot of hard work. So the work that Bally Loren does with us really puts us in a good position. So it's not just like oh my god, I didn't realise it was going to be so hard. So yeah, that's all good. Um. And then after that, so that's basically how, how we get ready to do to do the work and the work at the moment. Um, we've got a couple of battle scenes. I'll not tell you too much detail, but um, in some of the acts, we've got uh, a more stylized battle scene. And then we've got a more sort of um, cutthroat battle scene, a bit, bit more aggressive and violent. So we've been looking at, we've been looking at those and how we'll always mark it to run through and then look at look at shapes that we're creating um, it seems to be in the rehearsal room with Ballerin and with Lorne our director we'll work a lot with shapes um, and it's all about sort of finding the colour in the scene finding the shapes we want to work with what looks aesthetically pleasing what to us as actors performers feels right to be in that sort of position um, and yeah so we looked at one of them there's another one which I'm involved in I play a character Valve who has a duel with Serrano de Bergerac um and it it's it's sort of it's called the the fight fight of the well fighting of the ballad. Serrano delivers a ballad ballad while he's having a duel with this Balbear character that I play. Um and to really physically demand that was absolutely knackered today. But really good. We've started to get some really colour into it, some some good shapes. Um and I think yeah, I think it'll be really good. And it's great because as performers, me and Nigel, who plays Serrano, we, we have the, the freedom to be able to play with 
with the moves, not everything's set, which is nice. But it's not just worked to a beat, it's not worked choreographed. There's a sense of it, and then we can still embellish it. So hopefully, on tour and things, it'll still be developing. Obviously, hopefully, well, we'll remain safe when we make these changes, and obviously we'll have to rehearse that. But um, yeah, it's really good. Good way to work. Really enjoying it. Uh, in the afternoon today, we focus on Act Four, which is which is a big act. A lot of things happen, um, and I play one of the cadets as part of North, where we're sort of the ensemble. So we take on various roles at like the bakers, uh, the poets, um, cavalrymen, marquises, things like that. But this this what we're looking at is the cadets, uh, and just just how. In this one scene, the starving, the starving soldiers. They've been, they've been, um, they've been where they are for a year. It was a hell of a long time, and they've not had any food. And the the Spanish are trying to invade, and there's, there's loads going on. It's just trying to get yourself in that sort of mindset of hunger, fighting. You're angry. You don't know what's going on. The people who you live with are. You think that you think they're turning on you, get a bit delirious, and it's just playing with all these different different things. So today we sort of worked on that and how how again the shapes are on the stage, where we're at, what what weaponry we might have, are we armed, are we not armed, what does it mean to be armed, that sort of thing. And then we just sort of battled on through Act Four today, and I think we aim to get to the end of Act Four today, but because there's so much goes on and there's a lot to a lot to iron out, um, we didn't actually. We didn't actually uh, get to the end of the day, so we're going to concentrate on that again tomorrow. Um, but it's really good. It's really good. It's a great show, and I, I, I can't wait for for its developments and what what's going to happen in the future. So I am I am really looking forward to it. Um, but yeah, that's it. Really, it takes me about an hour and a half to get home. So I thought I'll come through the door, get this done while I'm still got a little bit of a buzz on. I'm going to go get some scran, but um. Yeah, this is the first time I've ever done this sort of vlog, so stay tuned if you want to see what happens uh, Tuesday of this week.